The man dubbed Britain's Bill Gates is missing after a £14 million luxury super yacht capsized off the coast of Sicily. Mike Lynch, a billionaire tech entrepreneur, is one of four Brits missing after the boat carrying 22 sank early this morning. He's one of six that haven't been found after a tornado struck the vessel as high winds lashed the Italian coastline. Lynch's wife is reportedly among those who have been rescued after the vessel sunk at around 4am. It was around 300 metres out to sea from the port of Porticello. Lynch is a billionaire tech entrepreneur who has been dubbed Britain's Bill Gates after having sold a business to HP for £9 billion. One of the other missing is his lawyer. He was extradited to the US after he was charged with inflating the price of the business by a fraudulent amount. He was acquitted of those charges in June. The six missing are four Brits and two Americans after the Canadian chef was found dead with the wreckage, Italian media have reported. The body of one dead man was found with the wreckage 160 feet below the surface of the Mediterranean. Search and rescue services including divers and helicopters are desperately still looking for those missing. The luxury boat, named the Bayesian, is a charter vessel with the second highest mast in the world. It costs a whopping £166,000 per week to hire. One incredible story of survival has already emerged from the shocking tragedy, with a mother revealing she rescued her one-year-old child from the sea. Brit tourist Charlotte used all her strength to keep her baby above the water after they were forced into the choppy waves. She revealed to Italian newspaper La Repubblica that she, quote, screamed for help, but all I could hear from around me was the screams of others. Charlotte, her child, and a group of 11 people treaded water, but were able to get on board a blow-up life raft and head to safety. Almost all of the 22 passengers and crew on board are said to have been inside their cabins and rooms when the weather took a turn. The yacht was said to have started to sink just off the shoreline, with its anchor still down as local crews of fishermen quickly spotted the distressed vessel and managed to help raise the anchor and save those in the water. Search and rescue teams using divers and helicopters were desperately looking for the six missing people today. The ship is managed by Camper and Nicholson's International. A spokesperson for the company told the BBC that they are dealing with a situation on board one of their managed vessels.